Horus, written by George Sand, is a compelling novel that delves into the complexities of human relationships, societal expectations, and the pursuit of individual happiness. Set against the backdrop of 19th century France, the narrative follows the life of the titular character, Horus, as he grapples with the conflicting forces of duty and desire. One of the central themes of the novel is the tension between personal aspirations and societal norms. Horace, a young man with artistic inclinations and a free spirit, finds himself torn between the expectations of his conservative family and his own yearning for a life of creative fulfillment. Sand masterfully explores the societal constraints that limit individuals' choices, especially during a time when conformity and tradition held significant sway. The character development in Horace is rich and nuanced. Horace's internal struggle is portrayed with depth, and readers witness his evolution from a conflicted young man to someone who ultimately asserts his own identity. Sand employs psychological insight to dissect the internal conflicts faced by her characters, revealing the intricate interplay between societal pressures and personal desires. The novel also presents a critique of gender roles and the limited opportunities available to women in 19th century society. Sand, herself a trailblazing female writer in a predominantly male literary landscape, infuses the narrative with a feminist undertone. The female characters in Horace are not mere accessories to the male protagonists but individuals with their own dreams and challenges. Through their experiences, the novel sheds light on the restrictive nature of gender expectations and the quest for autonomy. The setting plays a crucial role in Horace, offering readers a vivid portrayal of the cultural and social milieu of 19th century France. Sand's meticulous attention to detail captures the essence of the time, from the aristocratic salons to the bohemian corners of the artistic community. The contrast between these worlds serves as a backdrop for the character's struggles, highlighting the disparities and rigid social hierarchies prevalent in the era. Art and creativity emerge as powerful motifs in the novel, symbolizing freedom and self-expression. Horace's passion for painting becomes a metaphor for the character's yearning to break free from societal constraints. Sand explores the transformative nature of art, depicting how it can be a vehicle for personal liberation and a means of challenging societal norms. The narrative structure of Horace is noteworthy for its exploration of time and memory. Sand employs flashbacks and introspective moments to unravel the character's pasts, providing insights into their motivations and choices. This non-linear approach adds depth to the storytelling, inviting readers to piece together the puzzle of the characters' lives. Sand's prose is both eloquent and evocative, capturing the emotional nuances of her characters with precision. The novel is not merely a plot-driven narrative but a lyrical exploration of human emotions and societal complexities. The author's keen observations of human behavior and her ability to convey profound truths through the experiences of her characters contribute to the enduring appeal of Horace. In conclusion, Horace, by George Sand stands as a timeless exploration of the human condition, examining the interplay between societal expectations and individual aspirations. Through rich character development, a vivid historical setting, and a keen understanding of human psychology, Sand weaves a tapestry that resonates with readers across generations. The novel's themes of personal liberation, gender dynamics, and the transformative power of art continue to make it a compelling and relevant work in the canon of classic literature.